MPL, what's up? What's up, everybody? Welcome back. Madden 24. We got two games left in the season, then we jump into that uh, playoff, so we're getting through pretty nicely. You know what I mean? Finish this joint up and get ready for that. Uh, um, I was gonna say any given Sunday. No, uh, get ready for that Mortal Kombat 1. Oh, yeah. Already got it pre ordered and everything. It's going down. I need speed. I need that speed, dog. But yeah, we're gonna jump into that MK1. Go crazy. Nah, we do. I know I like to play my favorite drill. Get as many touchdowns as possible because that other stuff is not it. Mm -hmm. All right, women, with the beaming. Ugh, you been going crazy. Literally, been, we've been just winning every game, yo. Ooh. Okay, ready. Like the first couple episodes, we was getting towed up. Now we did. Now we did. It's HRT. You know what I mean? Let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. Oh my goodness, the lag. That should kill me one game. Come on. Come on. Okay, so we got the Seahawks. I'm sorry, ass Texans. I think it's 18 games, so I think I got three more. Ta da! Ta da! Three more going. Say goings. Three more games. Then it was playoff time. Here we go! Here we go! No, I mean. Ugh, trying to trying to win trying to win one. Come on, come on. The last Madden series I did, I literally lost to Tom Brady in the last game. Here we go, Shaq. Hold. That's right, and I want to throw it over there. Take it though. Oh, he didn't catch it. Oh my goodness. Shaq. Mm. Come on. I'm back in there, man. Mm. Ah, so close to the silver. So close to the silver. Alright. Seahawks. No, I'm finna throw them in. They throw back. Let's see what that playoff picture looking like real quick. So right now we the fourth seed. Rematch with the Bengals. They tore us up in the early in the league. Yeah, you know I mean, Seahawks. They're not even in the picture. Mm. Let's do it. Seahawks time. Nah. See that one right there? <sighs> See when I first started playing Madden? That's what them boys used to look like. And as I got older, they never looked like that. Like that. But we're gonna go to the. Uh, Oh, they don't give me that way. That's crazy. Guess we're going down on this. Like 
YOLO, you only live once, right? Oh, I'm holding, I'm holding. Telling. Telling like Mullen. Let's do it. Come on. It's the NFL on EA Sports. And we've got the Titans' electric quarterback. He's been sensational as he leads the league in touchdown passes. It's the Titans and the Seahawks next on Madden NFL 24. You know them throwback jerseys, helmets, the whole uniform. All in all, we have a pretty Fuego. December day in the volunteer state. The chilly rain from last night has moved on. The temps have bumped up a bit here at Nissan Stadium in Nashville. It is week 16 in the NFL, and we've got a good one in store, as it'll be the Seattle Seahawks taking on the Tennessee Titans. Boy, peace. With Charles Davis, I'm Brandon Gordon. Charles, we take a look at this Titan ball club entering play. They come in off another victory a weekend ago. That ran their win streak up to seven now. Going crazy, yo. So the Titans set to go to work for the first 25 time. pass attempts. Oh, the uniforms is crazy. So you know how we do. We start off with a handoff to Henry. Let that man go crazy real quick. They'll start on the ground. Like I said, let that man go crazy. He stiff arms him. Oh, and now some space down play. Damn. First play of the game. Touchdown, Titans. Derrick Henry. Milestone career touchdown number 100. Joining Curtis Martin and Franco Harris at the century mark as he continues to climb the all time list. And the tight boy went crazy on him. Top of the game's first score here this afternoon. That boy went crazy on him. Yeah. Stiff arm that dude. Get off me, little man. Just keep it pushing, man. 6 0. Bird nip. Come on, man. Come on. Come on. Come on. Let's go. Let's go. Oh, they scored on me, too. Back out of the field for their second drive. Well, partner, you know, coaches always say that every play is designed to score a touchdown. Sometimes that's not really true, but last drive, that was the case. One play to get into the end zone, and now they'll try to duplicate that success here. And it's rare for those... I was about to say, incredible when they do, and you saw the celebration. Go head to head with them dudes on the sideline. Another fine carry from the NFL's rushing leader, and quarterbacks typically dominating the MVP balloting, but I think you got to give this guy serious consideration, don't you? I agree totally. I mean, he's leading the league in rushing, and let's face it, partner, the running dude. Renaissance in the NFL. Yeah, step out of sense. Out of bounds. He's a problem. He was wide open. Consideration for MVP time. Another nice little ass head. <laughs> Between those lines, yeah, back to back good plays have him on the move on first down. He'll look to throw. Oh, shit. Oh, that nearly trouble, but it's incomplete. The rookie had it and lost it, and it'll be second down. Stand that ball off. You ain't trying to eat. Henry up the middle. That's why, that's why a hot uh, playmaker you to the other side, man. You talk about the crazy defense. They're a unit that struggled some against the run, no doubt, coming in 25th out of 32 teams. And when people talk about facing a challenge, they're... Damn, wrong button. ...this ball game because the number one rushing unit in the NFL, which means it's going to be a contest they've got to be prepared for from the first snap. Well, they certainly mm -hmm. looking rusty. Push that ball downfield, but as soon as he released the throw, the corner was there to slam that window shut. It's looking rusty. And here comes Tennessee as they get set to take the field. Let's hand that ball off. Come on. They're playing back and forth with us. Has that, has the, has that invisible juice wear off? God, dog. He's loose at the 40. Now look at him. To the 20. Touchdown, Titans. Derrick Henry. That's his 18th 
rushing touchdown of the year. And the Titans have taken the lead. God, dog. Boy, I can't even get no shine. This dude going crazy. Explosive. They lead the league in scoring. And another example of just how good they are right there on that play. Yeah, we often overstate about how explosive teams are. But this team is truly a threat to score on every snap, especially on the first few plays of any series. And a big strike like that, that only end. My man Hogan. Now here's the signal caller getting ready to lead this offense again. You trying to go pound for pound with me? They have been good running the football. And they have the lead, though, so maybe he just personally wants to improve his play. And that's without a doubt, because at the end of the game, <laughs> he wants to feel like he had a really good hand in his team winning if, in fact, they do go on and get that done. But the bottom line is... If. Oh, yeah, we finna get this dub. What you talking about? But somebody else is on the team. Charges are not good. Yeah, not over yet, but looking... In the world is going on. One play has him up past the 40 already and another first and 10. Back to throw. Supposed to be picked. I've seen that a mile away. 26 minutes. I take it though. It's another first down. So many times in my career, I've heard coaches talk about completions. Are right. String pretty tight though, you know. Catch. We get guys on the ground. A couple more games in playoff time. We fourth C right now. After the catch, then your defense is going to be in a lot of trouble. Here's a fourth C. Yeah, so give him two yards there on the completion, and that'll make it second down. The Titans coming in looking for win number. But the Bengals just lost. And they come in on the heels of yet another victory. That ran their win streak, Charles, up to seven now. And I think that that last win, that established them and stamped them to me. The Super Bowl performers are kind of extreme confidence. And with the Bengals loss, if I win this, that bumped me up to five. Oh, because they're fifth. Let's get their tight ends involved. They can move the football. Here, a nice route. Able to look it in and picks up the first down. Yeah, that boy's going crazy. So the ball okay. is 16 here for first and 10. They'll stick with the passing game as he looks to throw. Dang. But it's incomplete. The pro bowler, DeAndre Hopkins, the intended receiver. But it's going to be second down. Pro Bowl. They'll look to throw again. Come on. It's a Titans touchdown. You know I was going to put some points on the board. I couldn't let my man run it all day. Touchdown on the year. And the Titans are able to extend their lead. Can't let my man run it all day. I'll let you do the analysis, partner. But with every touchdown pass his young quarterback throws and with the success that his team has had, I just continue to be more and more impressed. Let's both do the analysis. Impressed. Aren't we both? Yeah. I mean, and why shouldn't we be? Man, are you on my day? Their quarterback leading this offense back out. He had the touchdown pass last time. Yeah, know how we do. Hand it off first play. They'll start this drive out on the ground. I was about to say. Before being brought down, second and right at a yard. And now, thought my man was going to break another one. But juice up the guys for moving the football. I mean, if you're an offensive lineman, people running it, actually the guy calling plays, you're almost jumping up and down jubilation. Oh, my goodness. And big time options. You might want to think about play action and try and get something cheap right here over the top. Early for the set. game's been working well, and the offensive line has been pleased by that. The thought process there catch those safeties creeping up, trying to help against the running game. They tried to hit them over the top. Oh, I thought he was going to catch him. And he's got a first down, following a pickup of about 13, as we will take a pause here for the two minute warning. This is going to wind up incomplete. Part of what we're seeing so far is the defense is certainly coordinated. Both yeah, doing their jobs in tandem. The back helping the front, the front helping the back. 
The pressure got home on that last play and forced him to try and throw through contact and short it. Man, stop running out of bounds. Hey, but a running on this game? That's one thing I ain't never like that damn noodle running. With a third and two coming up, they got eight yards there. They'll come to the line needing only two yards to gain the first here. Hey, you know I'm going to take those yards. He does have the first down. Take what they give me. You know what I'm saying? They'll look to throw now on first down. Come on. That's caught inside the trial. Yeah, see how I stepped up in that pocket. Got my time ready on. Hitting double digits with his tenth touchdown of the season. And the Titans are able to stretch out their lead. You know what I'm saying? Get them boys with that Peyton Manny light. He makes one of these plays. I, I think the front office they get a bigger and bigger collective smile because they feel more confident that they have found their guy, their future at quarterback. And they should feel that way. Damn yeah, right, they found their future. You know what I'm quarterback with his I'm him. To take over once more. He had three touchdowns. We got the ball back again. Don't mind if I do. They'll come out throwing here to start the drive. Mm. It's complete to Hopkins. Passes is so pretty. They get this all the way to midfield. Marking down at the 49. The catch and run good for 24 yards. Damn, yes. This is a nice example of it. Tan it up. Scheming his guy open. Just a little underneath route. Just trying to free up some space. And it worked awfully well. Got him not just space, but plenty of room to run after the catch. Uh. I should have passed it over the top, being greedy. So we've reached halftime here. Let's throw in a broadcaster cliche, shall we? Both teams looking for a gift on Christmas Eve. As we'll head down to Orlando, that's where we find our man Jonathan Coachman at our EA Sports Halftime Report. Coach! All right, Brandon, thanks very much. Welcome in everyone to this Christmas Eve edition of the EA Sports Halftime Report. So let's get to it. We'll get started over at Mercedes-Benz Stadium in downtown Atlanta. And those two are tied up as they play the second quarter. Hmm. Next, we head down to Houston to check on the Texans at home at NRG Stadium. And for the moment, they trail the visiting Browns in that one. They always play the Browns every year. A touchdown reception. And it has too. Lastly, let's get you to Charlotte, North Carolina check on the Panthers at home at Bank of America Stadium. As you can see the score there in the second quarter. Christian Watson, a touchdown reception. Christian Watson. It was Derrick Henry, as he normally does, making his impact felt in that first half. He's already over 200 yards rushing, as he's well on his way to what could be a record-breaking performance. Does he really run like that in real life? Yeah, you gotta show me some love. I went crazy. Mm -hmm. Gotta show me some love, 2B. The Titans offense gears up for their first possession of the second half. Alright, let's see what we're gonna do with it. A first down carry for Henry. Pushes past him. Oh, he sheds himself free. And God, across the 30 yard line. 214 yards rushing now for the NFL leader coming into this ball game. The ball on the 32. It's second and two. Here's a play fake as they set up to throw. And up top. Downfield by Burks. Come on, give me that. Give me that yak. Give me that yak. Touchdown. And a touchdown. Hey, my Hughes. Touchdown number two in the game, and that's 11 on the year. And the Titans are able to strike quickly to add on to their lead. And remember, partner, that's mm -hmm. the quarterback back there. Apparently, mm -hmm. That three touchdown passes. You're right. He looks comfortable. What are they doing? Anything in particular? Well, they keep talking about making sure they're giving. Making sure they give me the ball. Tennessee ready to begin this drive offensively. I'm trying to come back. Let's see what they're doing. A little 
like ain't nobody playing no defense. They'll start on the ground here on first down. Come on, baby, you got running the ball. Four, it's second down. It's time for them to be good teammates right here. What I mean by that is possess the ball for a little while. Get at least two first downs. Give their defense a chance to settle down a little bit after they give up a touchdown. Mm, let's go. Left side on the swing pass. The solid stick. For a beast. That's the 40. The 40's out of bounds. The Titans get 14 yards there and move the chains as well. This offensive game plan has just been sensational. I mean, when you think about 10 a.s. They've got their receivers open so far. It's really been impressive. Scheme, design, execution. Now here's a throw. It's good. Mm. And he'll be out of bounds just shy of the 40. 15 more there, and they're on a roll. It's another first down. And now we get into the psychology of the whole thing because a lot of teams with a two-score lead in the third quarter, they almost become defensive with their offense, just playing not to lose. I think with this team, you got to figure at this point, this is a great spot for them to go. That <laughs> boy crazy. Really try to put the hammer down and finish this one off. Yeah, he's out of bounds, but not before a big pick up that time. And what's going to wind up? My Eagles 10 and 4. If I see him in the Super Bowl, I'm going to have to do him in. Corner here on Christmas Eve. You know? We'll return with more after this. You're watching the NFL on EA Sports. Christmas Eve. On first down, he'll drop to throw. Mm. It's caught in the end zone. Tennessee. DeAndre Hopkins from 21 yards away. And the Titans are closing in on win number 10 as they extend this fourth quarter lead. Yet another touchdown in what has just been a high-scoring affair, a fun one to watch, and it's the rookie quarterback. Is doing them in. And these are just trying to. They're trying to go pound for pound. Scores on the plus side. Still time here in this fourth quarter, but maybe you start thinking about playing keep away. Yeah, I think here's the situation. You're not thinking touchdowns anymore. You're just thinking first downs. Look at that. Keep away. First downs. They can't touch the ball. Power all that. That dude going crazy. Derrick Henry, his 21st touchdown of the season. And the Titans have pretty well put it away here in the fourth quarter. Damn, 21 of them things. To settle in for that drive, a quick strike of 75 yards, and they find the end zone. Don't you get the sense that film study was behind this one, that they saw something that they thought they could take advantage of? The key is calling it in the right situation, knowing what it is. I ain't gonna lie, this game is lit. They did exactly that. They've got to feel really good. God damn, what are these boys are scoring, ain't they? To take the field. My defense looking on ice. Inside handoff, hit. It's a six-yard pickup, but he's still got 320 yards. Well, at this stage, that's exactly what you want offensively. Good run on first down. Stay in bounds. Keep that. Go ahead. Go to his two-minute warning. Chart that the play caller has in his hands right now. That's what you got to focus in on because. That's the they they right Four-minute offense section. What running plays do we have to bleed down the clock and take care of the football? Right now, they're executing really well. He's going to get it again. Just looking to get forward and protect the ball. There you go. Oh, don't run out of bounds. And he'll go out of bounds after taking it a little further down inside the 40. A gain of five, good enough for the first down. Don't run out of bounds. Five points of contact necessary at this stage as they run on first down. And now we're going to get a timeout defensively. So another stop, 150 left in the football game. They'll run it again with Henry. Man, he just did that line, man, like he was nuts in. One tackle, but that's about all as he's taken down. So second and nine, and you'd have to figure just about all 11, probably crashing the line here. Now a handoff to Henry. Mm. Yeah, he 
was able to shed one tackle but could not get away from there. Now the Seahawks forced to use their third and final timeout as they'll head to the sideline and talk over what to do next. Looking left side, that's hard down. And he is going to have the Titans first down, and that sure down. They're able to convert on third down, and that sets up the first and goal. They bring pressure there on third down, but this is a nice job of picking it up and making sure. Third down. Go ahead, knee. And they wind up. Get a bone up out of here. You know what I'm saying? The Titans go victory formation down to a knee. I'm gonna run neck, clag out, shut out. Another dub on the board. So yeah, man, like I said, we're getting we about almost there because you know we're gonna get our Super Bowl along. Maybe we might do the Pro Bowl, see what that's about. But uh yeah, then we're getting ready for that Mortal Kombat 1, baby. Yo, shout out to everybody that be watching my little videos, man. Clock counting down. Y'all real, real ones, man. Y'all real. Listen, anytime you take a knee to end a game, that means you've won it. So it doesn't matter whether it's home or on the road, but there's something a little extra special about doing it in front of your home crowd, isn't there? <laughs> and the home crowd applauding. They're happy with what they've seen. All that green. Up in the left-hand column for a win. Yeah, that's right. Head to the locker room, throw the wristbands in the crowd for the kids, your gloves, your towels. Get to share it with the home team. The home team. Yeah, man. We looking gooey. So he'll take a knee here to wrap this one up, and he's going to want to keep that game ball. He was sensational. It has a lot of happy faces heading into the title as this one ends, and understandably so. Not only did they get the win, but boy, their offense was on fire in this ball game. And partner, I have no idea what the top speed is on all those high-end sports cars. What's the top gear you can get into? This offense, they certainly were there in this one, huh? Everything clicked. Went crazy. All right, y'all. I'll see you on the next episode. Peace. It's too hot, yeah, hot, yeah, hot, yeah. I can never stop.